All right, we are alive. And, uh, yeah, I finally got this guy RPG working somehow. Somehow it works. I'm not going to question it because I didn't do anything out of the ordinary, but it works now. Let's go ahead and get that music going, huh? Didn't add too much more to the music playlist. Because we're like a little over 250 right now. I'm trying to get through some of this if we can. Oh, we got a, uh, got a thing here. Follow me, please. Okay, please. Go, go, I think I do need to turn down the game. We can do that. There we go. That should be alright now. Alright, let's uh, commence the grind, shall we? Today's uh, background image is uh, Shadow Madness, by the way. Celebrating that the game came out on PC out of nowhere. And the more I think about it, I, I think I'm, I'm gonna be doing Shadow Madness after East Origins. But again, that's not guaranteed. Just because um, I just don't know what I'm gonna be set for. I don't know what's gonna be coming out. I don't even know. I just, I just don't know. There's a lot of factors. So we got more uh, JJ. So I didn't introduce a few new things with this big update, uh, but I really haven't explored it a whole lot. I'm kind of just winging it, really, at this point. Hey, JC. Um, uh, it's been a weird morning, uh, to say the least. Basically, I come home and uh, I have no mailbox. In fact, me and the neighbors have no mailbox. I gotta look over and the mailboxes are just like shattered to pieces. I'm like, what the world happened here? <laughs> Outside of that, it's been a pretty good morning though. Oh, things have been pretty well on your on your end. Hopefully, hopefully your mailbox is still up uh, good to go. But, uh, yeah, we're just, uh, finally, it seems like forever since I've streamed this guy RPG. I've been grinding what I can, it's just been, like, a slow process, but now that everything's working, like, everything's running smooth now in this guy RPG, it's, you know, I've been, uh, uh pretty into it. So I gotta turn the uh, the sky is six audio down. So if it's too low, I can only. Speaking of, uh, <laughs> so uh, for right now, my mailbox is still up, thankfully. Okay, that's good. You're good to hear that mailbox is still up. At least that's all it is. <laughs> still having my car troubles, but I'm gonna get a rental tomorrow, so to last me a bit. So hopefully it's fine. Okay, hopefully the rental ain't too expensive for you. Because, um, the only time I ever rented a car was, uh, for free, thankfully, because, uh, I had a incident with my, uh, car at the time, where, an, believe it or not, an ambulance backed up into my car, uh, but, but because it was on them, basically, the government covered my costs for free for repairing my car, and they even paid for my rental at the time, so I kind of got lucky there. But, you know, of all things, an ambulance. But regardless, uh, yeah, hopefully your car troubles get fixed up. But, uh, yeah, so we're 
getting pretty close to the uh, Ring Zero collab. I think it might be next week. Also, I have no uh, Fire Emblem Hero or Fire uh, Fire Emblem Heroes news thing said it this time. Though on Monday we get Legendary Kitty, and uh, while I'm not gonna pull for her, she looks good. Okay, that's cool. So she's the only uh, she's the only unit then I'm guessing. Wapping my oh, there it is. Bring it into fun times with Wing Spear after who knows how long. Okay, Wing Spear. It's actually kind of funny. We're training Pyra and uh, this guy is six, and here he is, she is. We get summoned for. Um, I want to check out the roadmap for this guy at six. Well, legendary uh, forces it's, it's includes a bunch of rare guys, and some of those I'm interested in. Okay, so you're more interested in the people that are coming with her. Gotcha. Now we do got a big daddy unit with this guy RPG that I'm, I'm not gonna pull too hard for, but I would like to get him if I can. I'm trying to find a rope. Of note for me, the are legendaries Faye and Lee Faye, as well as uh, not and Trainee. They're oh, they're uh, Fire Emblem Hero OCs. Gotcha. Let me look them up. She's a pretty cool design. Oh, right, okay. I remember seeing, like, the butterfly units, and they look really cool. Like, I really like that design. They should uh, do more OCs all more often if they're going to do one like that. Naya, RPG, February, Rogue. Or no, maybe not February, maybe not even March. Is it under I'm just gonna go to this Twitter account. So JP actually got the Witch in the Hundred Knights uh, units. Uh, so that's actually pretty interesting. More NIS characters, so that's pretty odd. Maybe someday we'll get the Phantom Raid. Yeah, the Nightmare- oh, they're Nightmares, okay, are pretty well designed. I like them more than the, uh, Good Dreams guys. Yeah, I, re I really do like them. their designs. They're pretty cool. 
Didn't know that was what they were called. I mean, I, I Alright, here we go. What can give you a competitive That is an ad. Get out of here. Let's see. Today's the 25th. Oh, they have not poached the rest of March yet. Okay. It's from the uh, previous story chapter, and the only downside is she's supposed to be a giant, and the game doesn't properly. Oh, okay. It's one of those situations. It's like, I am a giant. Please take my word for it. Alright, uh, so yeah, basically, I'm, um, I'm actually just going to do one pool each. I'm going to do one pool for uh, Pyra and Pico, and then I'm going to do a pool for uh, Overlord Laharl. Uh, Overlord Laharl is a really good unit, and uh, a lot of these units right here are pretty good units. But I'm only going to do one each, because I'm going to concentrate more on the Ray Zero collab that will be coming up pretty soon. Uh, let's do it. That's a good sign. That's a very good sign. I know, right? Let's do it. Let's go. Instant. Instant. I couldn't get Ivor Medalla, Medallia, but that's okay. Let's see. That's not Pico. They, granted, they both use guns, but that's not Pico. Alright, King Lahar. This is it. Let's go. King Laharl. None of this is a good sign. I... Love this song from Melty Blood. And <laughs> finally, Teenager Pico. Oh no. Pico, no. <laughs> I'm gonna leave this a couple times because I'm short time. Alright, no love. I'm, 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 I'm out. I'm only doing one of each. I mean, I'm saving the rest for the re zero then. So we actually don't have any events going on, so we can actually try to play catch up with some story. Well, let me do this first. I think they're gonna give us like kind of a chill thing. Oh, they, I, I gotta fix this up. Changed a few things here and there. Nice I 
I am pretty excited about Future Rosalia, though, speaking of Teenager Pico. Future Rosalia is going to be pretty tight. I'm definitely going to be pulling her, I'm pulling for her hard. Yeah, I might do one more pull for King Laharl if we get our, uh, our crystal total up a little bit more. But that's not, I'm not going to guarantee that. Because if I'm not mistaken, most of the Race Zero collab units are going to be like really top tier characters in this game. And there's going to be a fe special uh, Race Zero uh, flan. That comes with it too, and I wouldn't mind getting her. Now, my knowledge on Ray Zero is I know it's an Isika. I think one of the character like one of the twin characters, Ram, I think is her name is, is pretty popular. Outside of that, I don't know anything else about Ray Zero. Because I did not get a warrior to match that way. That's a lot of printies. Speaking of, they did something here, the printing version. This is new. on there. Elizabeth is probably my best mage. Oh, we can do another Roslyn. Let's go. Prison Rangers. I think Adele has. Yeah. That's actually getting uh, pretty buffed up. I don't mean I didn't mean to like train him up so high, but uh, here he is. Uh speaking of prison rangers, I'm pretty excited about um of losing Rangers coming at some point. When was that coming out, actually? Uh, volume 2. Printing Volume 2. Here I go. Yo, let's go, Super Roll Bars.
This item will be released, according to the Amazon, this item will be released May 2022. Okay, so... A couple, a couple more months before I, uh, Volume 2 comes in. And I already gave you got that from pre-order. That was, uh... Uh, that was one of my Christmas gifts. Uh, I used, to uh, like, my Amazon gift card that I, uh, had. And, uh, just pre-ordered. Just went ahead and pre-ordered that game. I didn't get the Super Duper Special Edition of that. Uh, I don't even think you can buy it off of Amazon. I think it's only from NIS's website. Like I did with the Phantom Brave and Soul Nomad one. Like, Phantom Brave was a definite. Like, I I, I went I went ham on getting that collection. But for this one, I'm, I'm alright with, like, a normal special edition. I gotta wait for a Pixel Remaster uh, final. I I'm definitely gonna pick up Pixel Remaster Final Fantasy 6 as soon as I can, but um, I'm not gonna be streaming it right away. Like, don't get me wrong, I really do like 6, I'm just, I I'm at the point now where I got, I got too much stuff streaming at the moment. But I'm really glad to hear that, uh, it's, at least from what I've seen so far, Pixel Remaster of 6 is pretty good. I actually saw your post, JC, about the, uh, the opera scene. Uh, how to get the different languages for, uh, the opera scene. I gotta go check them out at some point. Here's something you have fun with that. I have been watching Homer stream and it and it got a lot of uh, extra work put into it. It's wild. I, I I doesn't surprise me. It seemed like they definitely put a lot more. I mean, not to say the other ones didn't have effort, but uh, it definitely seemed like they put the most focus into Final Fantasy VI. I mean, for good reason. It's Final Fantasy VI. Um, I did catch his first session of uh, Final Fantasy VI. Not all of it. I had to go to sleep in the middle of it. But uh, I, I know he's done another session since then. I'm gonna. I got to go watch the stream. I'm probably gonna go watch it. I want to say this is probably my favorite Delta Rune song so far, but only the first half of the song. I really love this first half of the song. The other half is okay. Eh. Like, this song starts out so strong. Also, I say check it out after you've seen the uh, Pixel Remains for Person of Offer scene. Oh, yeah, for sure. I'm, I'm definitely going to wait till I watch the uh, the English version first in game. And then I'm going to go check out the other languages because that's actually, that sounds really fascinating. Shout out to the saxophone, by the way. <laughs> Gonna do next? I, I, the Pixel Remaster team. I wonder. I, I mean, I wonder if they're even gonna do anything after uh, after six and all. Like, I, I keep bringing it up, but I legitimately wish that they would make like the next big Final Fantasy game. Like Final Fantasy. I know we're already getting sixteen, but um, if they could just do like Final Fantasy seventeen, make it like retro, like a callback. I think that would be pretty rad. It's really cool to have proper vocals in the game, but it's more than that. Okay, you have uh, you got me pretty excited here, JC.
I love Final Fantasy. I love good music. It's a good combination. Got one. Us to create the most it won't let me skip it. Oh, excuse me. This is a Honda ad. My, uh, my apologies. Also, if you miss a Cyan got buff, you no longer have to wait for Vegito. Yeah, I saw Homer mentioning that. That's actually pretty cool. Shout out to Heaven for Persona 4. That's a good thing. Which makes me super happy since uh, he's one of my favorite characters. Yeah, Cyan's a pretty great character in Final Fantasy VI. Um, I'll, I'll, see, I'll see it when I watch Homer's stream. I was going to ask... Um, so, if Cyan no longer has to wait for his moves, he just has access to all of them, right? So that kind of makes his early ones obsolete. Or maybe they think I'll have to go check it out. Man, six, Six's cast is really good all together, though. Like, there's not a party member in Six that I actively dislike. There's certainly ones I like more than others, granted, but... Usually my final party in 6 is Saban. Dude, what do I usually do with uh, my final party? Saban's definitely one. I use Saban. God, I guess it has been a couple years since I played 6. I think he still has to unlock them, but... Okay, he still has to unlock them, gotcha. Okay, um, I you Actually, Cyan was... No, Cyan wasn't in my final party. It's usually Saban, Gal, Mog... Yeah, 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 it was Celeste. Yeah, that's right. My, yeah, that's my final, my, well, my final party, but, like, my main party was Saban, Gal, Celeste, and, uh, Bob. That was usually not my final party, like, my main party. But I, I, probably when it comes to Pixel Remaster, it's probably gonna change things around. Oh, no, what about the, no, it wasn't Mog, it was a... Dang it, Six just had so many good characters. Honestly, I probably switched them around a lot. That's probably why I'm getting so mixed up. Yeah, I definitely remember Edgar and Saban. I don't know. Six is a good game. Everybody should play it. Also, uh, since the RPG has been fixed up, I have not had it crashed on me once yet, so that's been great. When I get the Final Fantasy VI Spectral Remaster, I look forward to Terra, Save, uh, Cyan, Save, and whoever the heck I decide on the fourth character. <laughs> It's hard. Sorry, 
in terms of like party members I used to least oh, it would probably be Yeti and Strago. Strago and Yeti are probably like the two party members I used the least. Like heck, I used Yogo more than him. I mean, that's a good combination, though, JC. Terra, 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 Terra's such a good character. Also, who doesn't love Sage? Sage is great. Sammy gives you that hard sell when he suplexes to train. How can you say no to it? I know, right? There's actually a ROM hack of the original Final Fantasy VI on Super Nintendo. Uh, where you can, uh, they basically took out the restrictions about suplexing. So now, if you wanted to, you can suplex uh, uh, Kefka, the final, the final boss fight with Kefka. It's pretty great. Also, fighting game inputs in a Final Fantasy game. Yeah, they should do that more often, actually. <laughs> yeah. I wouldn't mind, like, a straight-up character that was just a, basically a fighting game in a Final Fantasy game. Like, honest, would Sabin be the closest one? Like... I'm trying to think of characters after Saban. Like, Tifa's was more towards her limit breaks, and so was Se No? No, Seal was input, wasn't it? From, uh, 8? Okay, so it would have been Seal. Seal would probably be the last character. Because Seal had a very similar thing like uh, Saban did with his, uh, limit break. I didn't use Seal too much in uh, Final Fantasy VIII. Oh, no, I did. Yeah, I did. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, because I used all the male characters in my, uh, my main party for FF8. Yeah, that's true. I'm actually looking forward to playing FF8 later down the road. Now that I've been working on this, like, RPG list, I, I, I legitimately am going to look forward to replaying Final Fantasy VIII and, like, being more in-depth with it and whatnot. Especially after some of the RPG games I've played, here we go. I still would like a, a, a traditional fighter Final Fantasy game. Like, I know the city exists, but... I want something more traditional. Like, my idea for a traditional Final Fantasy game would be you would take the, like, the martial art focused fighting game character. So you would have Saban, you would have Tifa, you would have Zill. Uh, I would actually make, like, the master from Final Fantasy 1, like, the, like, the really heavy character. Like, a hard hitting heavy character. I would make that the, uh, the monk slash master from, uh, Final Fantasy 1. I want to get back to Type Lumina. It's just that this week's been uh, rough, and I'm starting to find a comfortable rhythm in uh, Pokemon Leaf. Oh, uh, yeah. It's hard, it's hard to keep, uh, especially when you're older. You have a, you have to take, you have responsibilities. It's just so hard to sit down and find a time for these games. I need to get back to it, too, if it makes you feel better, JC. I gotta practice my ego. Gosh, she's such a fun character. I, I, I love Aiko and, uh, Tag Oh! It crashed. <laughs> well, okay, I see Tradition still lives on.
I am curious when, uh, who the next DLC character will be for Type Lumina, because we got two more coming, right? Yeah, it's two more. I definitely say Tight Lumina. Like, I have not been, like, really excited, like, into, like, a fighting game since Tekken 7. I, I believe, I'm honestly surprised she wasn't the first one. I'll be, I'll be frank. Like, I want her to be in, not only because I think she would be a type, uh, a, a neat character for the game, but I also want Homer to play it. So I can play against him. Probably another spoiler for um, remake for the other. Possibly, yeah. They can go in so many directions. Have they confirmed it's just these four characters, or are they gonna do, or like, or this is like, did they say like it's a season one kind of thing? Probably not. This is probably just gonna be it. I don't know. I don't want your whatever you're advertising. Oh, I didn't mention it. There was one more entry for the Friday Night Funkin' mod contest. Uh, but I kind of wanted to just jump into this guy RPG, so I'm going to take a look at it next week. I, I need to get on the ball with my mod. I need to get to work on it. They just said this season, I believe. That implies there could be more, but given how much work these characters take, I wouldn't be surprised with it. Yeah, me too. More than likely, yeah, that's probably what's gonna end up happening. Unless they come down, come out like like a, an enhanced version later down the road, or maybe add a character or two to that. But I, I'm 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 probably in the boat with you. I'm, it's probably just gonna be the just the four. Chances they would do another face character for DLC. I, I, I have a feeling it wouldn't be impossible, but I, I feel like that's probably low on the uh, priority list. Like, I'm sure there's a lot of popular face characters, but do they really match up the Saber? I like more, but yeah, yeah. All the characters. I know that. Just, just, just bring everybody back. Just make, just make it a mess. 
You know what? Make it a tag Mark Melty Blood game. That that would not go horribly, right? A tag Melty Blood game? Let's just let's just do it. God, that would be so that would be so busted, but so fun. Diabetes, let's go! I've actually been slacking on my, uh, uh, playing on this guy, I guess. I've been kind of, like, going back to taking naps during lunch at work, but, um, I need to stop doing that. I need to get back to, uh, manga slash, uh, this guy, DS. I've actually not read much of anything this month in terms of manga. I was trying to read more, too. But the only, um, the only manga I read this month was, uh, Chainsaw Man Volume 1. Which, going by Volume 1, it was alright. Like, I, I like, I like what I read enough to where I want to get Volume 2 of Chainsaw Man and try it. Like, I thought it was decent, but I, I don't, I don't think it's like... Like, I know people aren't saying it's the greatest thing in the world, but... I don't know. I, I, I guess I'm not the... I'm the Chainsaw Man hype train. I think the artwork looks great in it, though. That, that, that's actually really good. I don't know, maybe I've just, like, gone down the romance comedy rom-com manga thing too far now at this point. We can reincarnate anybody in the uh, party at the moment. 
I need to get to work on my uh, magic party too, actually. I need to start uh, trying to buff that up a bit. Seems like everybody's having fun with Elden Ring, so that's pretty good. Oh yeah, I saw where Street Fighter is doing a crossover with uh, the King of Fighters All-Star. So we literally have a King of Fighters game that has Street Fighter, Tekken, Guilty Gear, and WWE all in one place. That's kind of nutty. me being an old man, to be fair, like, I don't know, I kind of like the roughness to it, at times, but not to say that the new, like, the way anime is made now is, like, bad or anything, it's definitely, I, I, I'm sure it's a lot, I, I was about to say a lot easier on the, uh, people making it, but I, knowing the anime industry, I know how hard it actually is making an anime, uh, from what I've read nowadays. Gay RPGs at you, are you? <laughs> I should add all to this guy, but uh, hello, welcome to the chat. Hopefully, your day has been going pretty well so far. I still have to get an emote. Alright, yeah, so in JP, uh, currently they got the, uh, the, the character from, uh, the Hunter, uh, the Knight, uh, Witch and the Hunter Knight and, uh, Girl Lahara switching outfits, cause, uh, I guess Girl Lahara was really popular. I never got the impression that she was, actually. I completely forgot about the Disgaea poll. Who was the, uh... Popular character. 
Pride Frog? Oh, we, uh, we, we will take the Pride Frog. Pride Frog is pretty, uh, pretty, uh, pog, I think it's pretty insane. Okay, the ReZero collab starts March 3rd. Got it. Wow, the website went all out. I'm gonna post this in chat just in case anybody's interested in looking at the, uh, what we'll be getting. Me personally, I'm gonna try to go for, uh, Oni Flan. Oh no, they call it, uh, wait, Flan Bash? Is that what they're calling it? Okay. That's a very powerful pride heart. <laughs> That's probably a little bit. I gotta say, the Rape Zero characters look pretty good in the, uh, this guy, uh, Arthur. Waifu Flan. Flan's pretty, uh, pretty, pretty cool. Pretty cool character. She's not my personal favorite this guy character, but, uh, she's, uh, she's still a pretty cool character. Wait, are we literally gonna get uh, Ragnarok characters after Ray Zero? Oh, we actually got Pico and Pyro early. Okay, we weren't supposed to get them until after Ray Zero. Oh, we were supposed to get Mizador too, but we haven't gotten him yet. Oh yeah, I was gonna look at that, uh, the popularity tool. Oh right, okay, so it was Etna, Laharl, Favatoris, Flan, and Usalia was the most popular characters, at least in English. Right, and I, I was like, I was like laughing because somebody voted for Volcanus from Sky 1. I still won't get over that. I definitely, I know when it comes to Disgaea, outside of Disgaea, like, like, in terms of, like, if you ask, like, a normal, I, 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 I don't know if there is such a thing as a normal gamer, but, um, like, people who's not familiar with Disgaea will at least be familiar with Etna and Prinny. Outside of that, I don't think most people who doesn't know about NIS games know anyone else other than those two. Girl of Harlow got 300 codes, so okay. that's what I'm curious about. What do we got here? Alright, I am very jealous of your Tyra of Avatoris. 
I'm gonna get mine up there at some point. Maybe. Like, I have not reached any characters to level 9,999 yet in this guy RPG. But yeah, I don't, uh, I don't mind adding you to the friend list. Oh, you got, uh, you got that over well. That's pretty cool. That's a pretty good final party. I have Awakening Rosalind, and I have Vampire Falva Torres. And I, I have a Soggy, too. Oh, I know why. I know why. I know why. I don't think they were coming up in my thing, but uh, I'll check later. Search by no oh, Okay, gotcha, gotcha. I will do that. Oh, you have, uh, Overlord Asagi. Yeah, I have her, too. She's pretty good. Fallen Angel. Seven trillion damage taken. I probably got more to that, so she's cool. Oh, Overlords? Yeah. Did you get, um... Did you get, um, Tyrant Overlord Naharo yet? Or are you gonna fool for him? Okay, yeah, you got him. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 
Already got, already putting the work into him, it looks like, too. Nice. I'm a free to play player, so I'm kind of saving up for uh, the Ray Zero event myself. I did try to do, I did move one pull for him. Oh, you're a free to play player too? Nice. I'm turning this up a little bit. I like this other cover. Okay, it must be three. I don't know, man. Those fish are, uh, they're pretty terrifying. At least on my end. I, I, I really need to get, uh, hardcore with this guy RPG, like, but at the same time, I, I take our, this guy RPG, like, really casual. Like, I, I'm just here for the, like, just for the fun of it. And no auto. And no auto. I, I, I need to I need to do everything manually myself. At some point, like I, I'm really terrible at just keeping everything on auto. Manual, right? All right. <laughs> I killed the fish. Plus, I gotta grind for more material, too. Like, I I'm kind of right way behind with the uh, reincarnating material. But that's, that's what I'm doing right now. Yo, JC, you added some uh, GameCube Super Robot Wars? Let's go. This sounds really good. Right, yeah. I'm, I'm just, uh, I like to go for the material first before I uh, do the uh, EXP. I'm actually, um, after this, I'm actually going to be doing more of the story. I need to play catch up on the story first. But, uh, greatly much appreciated, though. Yeah. 
Ah, I don't remember how to do this one. Oh, I haven't even done that yet. <laughs> I mean, Renaissance does their best. So we uh let's go do some more story stuff. Cause I am so far behind with this.
the will of Avatarus. You're going to show us the powers of Sardines, my dude. Let's see, what else has been going on in the video game? I know we got the Street Fighter 6 teaser. I love seeing some silly Twitter stuff. Let's see, video game news. I'm kind of surprised people are really excited about Poppy's Playtime, honestly, because I know the developers were trying to advertise NFTs about it, and uh, they quickly deleted that. Like very quickly deleted that. I'm kind of kind of surprised people are not more onto them about it. I have no idea what this is. It's 
actually pretty nice being able to grind not only the Sky uh, RPG again, but uh, along with uh, the Sky uh, 6 in the background as well. Um, I know we're going to be getting the Sky 6 complete for PlayStation 4 uh, later down the road. Uh, I'm probably not going to pick it up right away. I'm, I'm going to concentrate on trying to complete the Switch version. But I wouldn't mind playing complete later down the road for, like, trying to get all the trophies for it. That's actually something I've been wanting to do for a while now. I want to do, like, a dedicated, uh... Some, like, dedicated streams for, uh, trophy hunting. But it just it hasn't really come up yet. Win for justice. Look, I'll just say Tekken 5 soundtrack is like the best in the series. But there's a few, a few Tekken 7 songs that I really like, and this being one of them. say Tekken 5 soundtrack in general. Uh, when I say Tekken 5 soundtrack, I mean Fidelify. 5. Um, I think it's the best fighting game soundtrack, period. Like, I'll be straight up. Of course, that's my personal opinion. Oh yeah, Sony's doing a Game Pass thing too. We'll see how well that goes. I just, I really just prefer to buy digital games as a one rather than having to pay a full pass and access to all of them. I mean, me personally, if I could have a physical copy of the game, I would, but... I mean, I understand in some instances you're kind of stuck with digital games. Yo, Street Fighter 3, let's go. Also a fantastic fighting game soundtrack. Actually, it's pretty cool with the horror portrait. It's 
pretty good main menu thing. Should I add rap to my RPG Maker games? <laughs> Does anybody want to hear me rap over over battle themes in RPG Maker? What do we got here? Oh, Zenofuka? Pretty good. I heard she's a really good character. I see that Genesis one down there, too. Very nice. Very, very nice. I didn't get... I didn't get Xenofuka, unfortunately. But I mean... I, I don't tend to, like, really pull too hard. Like, I... Unless the unit is like really like one that I really really like or one that I think will be really like the Asagi units I went pretty hard on because I did want all the Asagi units and Overlord Asagi is a really good unit so that one was one that I pulled very hard for. And I say I'm gonna probably pull really hard for Ray Zero, but uh, I gotta have some. Cause I know Seda, I don't. I, we're probably not gonna get Seda and Seedle for quite a while, but I would really like them. Hey, this guy needs I don't. I, I think it came out in Japan already. They came out with an, uh, a tactical RPG game about hunting for food, I believe, and it actually was pretty interesting. I, I hope it comes over here. the song next. Actually, um... If you have any music you want to add to the uh, playlist, here's a link to it. But uh, we'll, we'll, we'll definitely play the, uh, the Asagi music just, uh, as soon as this one's over. Masagi. How did FL Studios open up? I didn't even touch you, FL Studios. What the world? I never played Printy 2. I played Printy 1, but um, I would like to play Printy 2 later on the road. I actually need to get the Printy Collection for Switch. I need to get that. So don't be afraid of uh, copyright. I don't mind if I get a copyright strike. I've happened, help, I've, it's happened a couple times. I, I don't mind. By the way, shout out to NIS for still following me on Twitter. <laughs> That's still pretty amazing.
See, I would dance, but uh, I'm, I'm, I have two left feet. I, I don't do see those. Oh, we got another Prison Ranger. Nice. That's one I don't own, actually. We actually have not gotten much authority. Good stuff. Seeing, uh, it popped up on my recommendations a couple of times about how to make Persona music. I might need to try to look that up just to see how it is. Maybe I can try to make uh, Persona like music. That'd be pretty funny. have a uh, playlist on YouTube. It's private it though, but um, about like music tips and tricks and whatnot. I need to, uh, I've been at it a lot more to it. I need to sit down and actually look, uh, look at some other ones. I know how to speak modern language, I promise. Did somebody get a Persona music tier list? Uh, I might watch this later. It's 30 minutes.
don't think I'll ever be like the greats when it comes to making music, but um, I definitely want to improve. And honestly, um, I'm kind of actually a little proud of myself because in the little time I've been actually making music, I definitely feel like I have improved from when I first started to what I'm in right now. I think I've, and I, I still got a lot of learning to go, granted, but I, I definitely feel like I have improved in some aspects. You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna pat myself on the back for that one. <laughs> I went from 10 second minis to 30 second minis. Minis. Oh, yo, let's go. Let's go, copyright. Anybody's ever saw the uh, somebody did a uh, DK64 rap when they rap to the thriller music, it was actually pretty funny. Speaking of, I never played the uh, Donkey Kong 64. I don't have no real drive to play it at the moment. Um, I would definitely like to stream one to uh, Donkey Kong Country 1 and 2 at some point. get through Super Robot Wars OG2. Maybe. I, I'm thinking about maybe doing a platformer game again. Because the uh, Mario Land 1 and 2 streams was actually really fun. I actually did have to enjoy that. Despite how angry I might have been at the end of the uh, uh, Land 2, but still. Classic emote. Many platformers on hand, oh, on hand. I might have some on my uh, Steam library. I do have Aladdin. I have that Disney collection, but it's about uh, mine. Mine's not the uh, Super Nintendo one. Um, I do want to play Yakuza Zero at some point, but that's not a problem. I don't know. There's just so many video games, and not to mention I'm about to add what ten more games this year, the ones that are coming out. But unfortunately, I got to start saving a lot more money because um, I, I haven't brought it up in stream yet. I don't believe, but, um, my rent has been raised, unfortunately, so, um, that's just, like, less money I could put into hobbies and whatnot, which, it sucks, but it's adulthood. A 
Also more JJ. the Valkyrie class so much. But hey, at least I still have her in this guy RPG. We're about to get a special Valkyrie class later down the road, too, and I'm pretty hyped for her. there is like have you guys like ever come across a song where you're not too big of a fan of the song or you're just like indifferent about it except one particular part of the song and you just like absolutely love it uh this is one of those songs for me we're at the part right now but yeah like the song is normally like yeah it's okay but, uh, there, like, there's just this one part of this song, yeah. <laughs> okay, so it's not just me. another 20 minutes or so before I end the stream. I usually do these streams uh, in two hours unless something has come up. But uh, it's, it's really good to be back in this guy RPG after so much trouble shooting with it. Don't miss a beat. No, I don't want any Oreos. an OC, uh, OC Remix song. I am subscribed to OC Remix on, uh, YouTube, and, uh, whenever a song comes up that I just, like, might be interested, I just throw it on the playlist. Like, I got some really old OC Remix songs from back in the day. Like, there's some Final Fantasy remixes from them that I still listen to, and I think they're, like, 10 plus years old at this point. Well, I mean, I know she remixes, um, uh, like, it's like, where people, it's like, it's like multiple, it's like all, all kinds of different people over there. I'd just say O Remix is a, just a general statement. This kind of reminds me of, um, uh, Crystal Chronicles a little bit. Final Fantasy Tactics remake, uh... I think the rumor for Tactics was a, um, was a remaster, if I'm not mistaken. I would be down for a remaster. I 
You know what? If you want to give uh, the Pixel Remaster people Final Fantasy Tactics, I, I, I would be on board for that. Oh my god, that's a really good idea. Sorry for the audio bugs here. Yeah, like, oh man, that's such a great idea. If the Pixel Remaster people can make, uh, do a Final Fantasy Tactics, oh, that would be so awesome. Like, I can't believe I didn't think about that before. Alright, more JoJo. But, uh, Final Fantasy Tactics has a great soundtrack as well. Honestly, Final, like, I don't think there's a Final Fantasy game that has bad music. Valadin of Hearts 2 Remake. Um, I've never played the second one. I played the first Valadin Hearts, but I never played the uh, second one. So I can really comment on that. But when, uh, when I played the first one, it was a pretty fun game. Now, but hear me out. Legend of Dragoon Remake. That's where the money's at. Maybe. You know what? If Square is starting to release stuff on PC, do a, do a remaster or a, do a remaster of uh, Legend of Dragoon on PC. I'd be down for that. Did I say Square or Sony? So I meant Sony if I said Square. Ah, uh, I, I love RPGs. <laughs> RPGs are good. That's actually what I mostly stream is RPGs. Well, you know, I do like the occasional Metal Gear and, uh, other stuff like that. As much as you say transform, I don't think you have really transformed too much. Unless you're talking about when you level up, that's you technically transforming. Which, in which case, okay, I understand. Oh, 
Oh shoot! Thank you, one uh Zarther for the uh for the follow. Hopefully I didn't butcher your name there. But uh thank you for the follow. Don't feel like you're pressured into it, but uh greatly appreciate it. I think after this, I'm gonna add some Final Fantasy Tactics uh, music to the playlist. And thank you again for the, uh, the the friend request and all that, too. XD, and big XD. Let's go, more Super Robot Wars. This actually sounds really cool. I need to go see you. Okay, thanks for coming out. You have you enjoy the rest of your day now. It's okay, BB. <laughs> BB and D. We're gonna be ending the stream in just uh like ten more minutes anyway. Yeah, it's been pretty fun. Just I, I like these chill, just relaxed kind of streams. Some traditions just never die. So let's see, Pyrus are is she her fifth character or sixth character? Yeah, she's our fifth character, so we got Marjorie. Ivar, Adele, Rosalind, and Usalia is left. Okay. Right 
Uh, before too long, we're gonna we're gonna get the ball eventually. does some pretty good work. Uh, this is um, Jamie and Sam Miller. He remastered, or he like recreate or restored the like Donkey Kong Country music. Um, he's also done uh, Super Metroid uh, uh, restores as well, which that's pretty rad. Has he done Brimstar yet? Oh, I love this. This is just good right here. This is an original song using the uh, Legend Zelda sound font. Uh, it was for a uh, Zelda ROM hack. It's actually really good. The, uh, the song itself, the ROM hack, um, is pretty okay too. Oh, I need to check. I didn't check about the innocent. Oh, shoot. I forgot about all about that. Oh, 
He's looking for lunch. Let's see. Wings, Chinese, uh, Mexican, starve. After this uh, song games, uh, we're gonna be calling it a session. In fact, I'll go ahead and. Uh... Yo, I didn't know about this. I. How did I not realize this was here? Holy cow. I'm a dummy. Search the item world? I completely did not do this, holy cow. Why did they do that next time? But yeah, that is going to be it for today's stream. I want to thank everybody who came out. Checked out the stream if it's just for a little bit and just chilled and hang out. Always a fun time. I want to. Thank anybody on the YouTube side of things who checks the re uh, checks out the replays. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, yeah, so tomorrow uh, we will be doing more Super Robot Wars. Sunday, I will try to stream Lost Vision. I will go ahead and say it's not a hundred percent guarantee because it'll be laundry day that day, and then I'm actually will be off instead of the normal two days. I'll be off four days, so we'll see what kind of hijinks we'll get into. But anyway, uh, that'll be it. Uh, thanks again, everybody. Stay safe, stay, uh, stay awesome, and uh, yeah, be excellent.